Hello guys, hey parents, hey kids, hey students. Uh, we're moving on to class number 16, which is the Katagatami Choke. All right, before we start the class, as you already know, we're gonna do the little warm up. Very easy, very basic warm up. Everybody knows how to do it. Kids, teens, adults, and, and parents. Jumping jacks. We're gonna start with a 30 seconds drill. Gotta be a perfect jumping jack, okay? <sighs> See, no, no, this is not a jumping jack. You gotta go all the way. You do 30 seconds, 30 seconds break, round number two and round number three, okay? Warm up, exercise two, sit-ups. I want you to stretch your leg a little bit, doesn't have to go all the way up, not down, right here. Try to get closer as, as, as fast as possible. Ready, go, one, two, three. Do not bring the feet to you. You gotta go get it, okay? You're gonna do 30 seconds. Take a quick break. Round number two, round number three. Now, third and final warm up exercise, shoulder touch. You're gonna get a push up position. Do not flex. Touch your shoulder for 30 seconds. Straight back, not like this, not like this. All the way, feet together. Go. All right. 30 seconds. 30 seconds break, round number two, round number three. And then you're gonna do the plus. You're gonna do the jumping jack, the sit up, and the shoulder touch in a row, 30, 30, 30. Take a 30 seconds break, you go round number two, jumping jack, sit up, shoulder touch, and then round number three, all right? should be uh, warmed up for the Katagatami class. Let's say that we're uh, on the self-defense um, aspect. You're in a street fight, the guy took you down. Because you know jujitsu. you're gonna close your guard. You're already on the bottom, okay? You are not expecting. Here. And remember, set up a good distance in case they start punching you. Go, start punching, look, see I'm setting up a distance and protecting my face. I'm gonna use one of those punches to do my choke, okay? Look, tap, sit up, pull back, move your hips a little bit, move your biceps, stretching, and finish, okay? Again, just let me go. Go, punch, 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 look. And then, Squeeze. Now, if you're in a jiu-jitsu match in a grapple and there's no striking, you have your, I like to put one up, <clears throat> lapel, sleeve. You're in control, so you're gonna move this and pull it. Some people also like the collar grip here, which is very good, uh, very good uh, grip too. See, I'm there, and then look, I, oh, I pull to me, hips to the side a little bit and then squeeze all right very easy very basic katagatami either striking or in jiu-jitsu now i'm gonna move to uh sideways katagatami which i like a lot you're gonna move your hips all the way to the side to finish your katagatami this way I'm here, okay, with my grip, I move. Now look, all the way to the side. I lock as a scissor around the stomach, biceps, cup, head, arm, and then you squeeze. You squeeze your legs around the kidneys, and you're choking also on the, on the neck. Make sure your body is all the way outside. See, I'm here, and then I move now. Look, hips all the way. See, I could go to the back, but I since I have the lock here, look, legs, biceps, look, and then I squeeze everything. It's a super powerful katagatami. The, your opponent is flat on the floor your body's all the way outside, okay? Now, we're gonna sweep and finish the katagatami on top position. All right, 
you can use two different swips. First, I'm gonna go up, walk. I'm gonna use the scissor. Look, I move outside and then I move my legs. I don't wanna leave the top mount, so I'm gonna hook the legs back there, look. And now I'm gonna drop my hips down and squeeze. And they will tap, right? Or I want you to pay attention on the little butterfly hook on this leg. Okay, remember, if you're punching you, go punch. Bam. Here. This, look. Hook the leg. Now look. You don't want to leave the top. Squeeze. Hook the legs. Hips down and squeeze. And then tap. Maybe you're gonna to come to the question, okay, but sometimes I'm on a top mount and I'm doing the squeezing and it's a little loose and they won't tap. I'm gonna show you another option, the fourth variation for the katagatami. Okay, here, you go up, drag down, do you any sweep you like it, scissor maybe, look. Okay. Now look what I'm gonna do. I'm doing here, put it in fingers, and I'm squeezing, squeezing, they refuse to tap. Look, get off the top, you can sit like this, you can squeeze, and you can go flat on your belly and squeeze. You can sit here, and then look. All right, it's a little detail. So, if you just made a slip, you have your katagatami locked, you're squeezing, they refuse to tap. Get off, have a sit, and move forward, look. And they tap. All right, hope you enjoy, I hope you like it. We did four different variations and basic tools for the katagatami joke. Hope you like it. Uh, we will be back next class with class number 17. Uh, thank you, soon we're all gonna be back. God bless everyone. Yes.